Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to be sharing with you this makeup tutorial and I've only used five drugstore products. So I'll be using the Collection 2000 Brow Kit, some LA Girl Pro Concealers. I'll also be using my Rimmel Lipstick by Kate Moss and a Maybelline Mascara. So you just want to start off with a bare face and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to be using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade 4. Now it's a little bit orangey and it's a little bit darker than my natural skin tone. So I'm going to be using it kind of like a colour corrector putting it underneath my eyes and around my mouth and also my forehead area just to colour correct a little bit. Then I'll be going in with my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Creamy Beige and I'll be using this to highlight. So I'm using both concealers as a foundation and concealer, a two in one, just to really give me a nice base and an overall look to the skin. After you've buffed everything out, I'm going to be using my Collection 2000 Brow Kit and this is in the shade Dark. I'll be using both of the darker shades just to fill in my brows ever so lightly with an angle brush and this just gives you more of a natural looking brow and then you just want to use a spoolie or a disposable wand, whatever you have just to brush through the brows just so they look a little bit more natural. I'll be taking that middle shade again and I'm actually going to be using this as a contour and it really works, I really like the shade as a contour and I'm also going to be sculpting my nose, just giving a little bit of definition to my nose with, with this product. So you don't actually need a contour shade. Again, I'll be taking the colour Fawn and I'll be popping this all over my eyelid, up to my brow bone because I do have a little bit of pigmentation on my eyelids. I'll then be using the Creamy Beige Concealer just to highlight under the brow bone because I really want to clean this area up and make it look really nice and neat. I'm going to go ahead and use my Collection 2000 Brow Kit and use the medium tone brown in my crease just going back and forth with my 217 brush because I really want this area to look nice and airbrushed. Then going in with that darker shade, I'm just going to be using it as a liner so I'm going to be popping the shadow as close to the lash line as I can. I'm not being too neat with it, it can be a little bit blurred out because we want a soft look. And I'll be curling my lashes and popping on my favourite drugstore mascara at the moment and it has been for a while which is a lasting sensational mascara by Maybelline. It really separates, it volumises, it lengthens, it does all of that jazz. Just do your top and your bottom as you want, it's quite a simple makeup look. So I'm just going to finish it off with my Rimmel Kate Moss lipstick in number 48. Now I'm going to be using this colour as a blush as well, so just kissing the brush and popping it onto the apples of my cheeks and then I'm just going to make sure that I really blend it out and it gives you a really natural blush which I really love so I don't need another product. Using my Collection 2000 Brow Kit with the lightest colour in the pack, I'm just going to lighten up the lips or give them more of a dusty feel and I want them matte. And that is it guys, I hope you really enjoyed this look and if you did, don't forget to subscribe.